Cebuah Baguio City, John Hay particularly, and with me right there is, uh, we have Alexis here, and this is JM over here, and that is Rex there, and this is the way going to Baguio, we're just still here in Carlatan, and uh, you know, it will take about uh, two hours uh, to, to be able to reach our destination. We're gonna go to Comgen Hay to do a customer satisfaction survey and hopefully we'll be able to finish all of this today and so that we will uh, start constructing a report for uh, this uh, project. So uh, join us as we go to the City of Pines. See you later. This is the Bell House. Right there. That's, that's the Bell House right there. Uh, this is a part of uh, the historical core here and um, uh, it's, been, it's been said that this is actually the only place right now that is being uh, managed by John Hay uh, already because all the others are, are already being uh, uh, ceded or leased to some developers so there's a lot of place here it's really beautiful I'll be able to, you know, uh, show you all of this as we go on this afternoon. So, all right. So I have here uh, a lecturer from uh, Diliman, from UP Diliman. Um, well, it's a premier, premier state university. It's actually the best state university in the in the Philippines. Jeff, face reveal, please. <laughs> oh, all right, there. That's Jeff. This is Jeff Diaz. Sir Jeff Diaz, okay, lecturer, is a chemist from the University, University of the Philippines. And uh, right now he gave very, very worthy suggestions uh, to what we're doing right now, which is a customer satisfaction survey for John Hay. Um, anyway, <laughs> don't be scared, okay? This is a free country, isn't it, Jeff? And, and uh, right here, we are still here in the, uh, in the historical core, which is a part of uh, John Hay. And I actually took a took time uh, a disturb <laughs> disturb sort of disturb Sir Jeff already. So thank you so much, Jeff, and enjoy the, the rest of the day. Okay, and I hope uh, in the future you can come to San Fernando and we can give you a tour of San Fernando City and going to San Juan. Okay, Jeff. And anyway, I have your number. <laughs> um, I have your number. <laughs> I can. And is that your name also on Facebook, Jeff? Um, I don't have Facebook. I don't do you don't do Facebook. Yes. Oh sorry, but YouTube. You do uh, yeah, YouTube? I YouTube? Account. I have a Google account. Oh you have a Google account. Okay, I'll just text you later on. Yes. Okay, so that I will not disturb you. Uh, you probably okay. would want to the secret garden. Okay, thank you so much. Okay. So well thank you, my dear. Okay, my name in in at YouTube, my YouTube account is Beyond Teachings. Beyond Teaching Zen. It's a very, very new All right, thank you so much, my dear. Bye. God. Okay, so there you go. I met a very young lad, Debonair, okay, from the University of uh, the Philippines. He's a chemist, he's a lecturer. Okay, so there you go. We're having a great time. Although he's 26. Oh, Alexis, face reveal. Alexis. Okay, <laughs> you're 26. Oh, you have the same age. Okay, and you know, he gave very worthy suggestions. This is a marker that stays 1903 to 2003. So this was during the American period. And uh, they must have come here to establish this place. So Camp Jin He is, uh, this is the, as I've mentioned, this is the, the Bell House. So this must have been established in 1903. And there is also a marker right here. Oh, excuse me. Benguet, the Igorots, there, look at, look at that, mm -hmm. okay, so here, it says, it says here, these are the relics of Camp Jan Hay American roots, twin seals adorn the portals that guarded the camp's main gate, oh, okay, so this is actually a relic, it's a relic of uh, American roots, mm -hmm. so they were able to preserve it, they, they just perhaps transferred
fast forward to this because this was supposed to be in the main cave. I'm now going to bring you to the amphitheater. This is, uh, I think, a very old part of uh, John Hay, uh, and there's a lot of uh, a lot of activities or events being held in the amphitheater. So I'll just take this. There's a lot of tourists and they're very happy they're taking pictures they're taking pictures of the place and uh, yeah I will not disturb them anymore mm -hmm. oh beautiful these are beautiful wildflowers very small ones but really beautiful so right now I'm headed to the amphitheater and uh, perspective of the place and I I'm not going to disturb the tourists in their musings of the place. Okay, this is the amphitheater. There's a lot of uh, there's, there has been a lot of events that uh, happen here in the amphitheater. It's an amphitheater view so like it's terraces like that. sunny very sunny today very beautiful Saturday morning and there's a lot of tourists uh, mostly the tourists that I've talked to they're from uh, out of town some are from Batangas, Laguna, Quezon City and uh, they like to come to this place because of the cool, cool air and the very restful environment so there I'm just gonna spend my camera I'm just gonna pan my camera take a look at and here is a beautiful willow tree with beautiful willow flowers all right so this is the Bell Amphitheater and it says here in the marker Major General J Franklin Bell commanding general of the Philippine Commission from January 13 1911 to April 15 1914 personally designed and supervised the construction of this semicircular amphitheater. The amphitheater measures 300 feet in diameter and will seat approximately 1,500 people. Five individual spectator stands were originally featured along with a sunken orchestra pit. The dry stone walls of the amphitheater were built by Igorot craftsmen. The hexagonal pagoda is made of solid concrete, measures 29 feet across, and has perfect acoustics. Completed in May of 1913, the amphitheater cost US dollar $1,427 1, uh, to build. $1,427 to build. The garden was named in honor of its designer in 1929. In 1916, William Cameron Forbes, second chairman of the Philippine Commission, wrote, General Bell's enthusiasm for Baguio knows no bound. So again, let's take a look at uh, the amphitheater, which was uh, built by... Um, who was that again? It was built by William Cameron... Oh no, General Bell. This is... This is uh, Made. This is made by Major General J. Franklin Bell. Okay, so let's take a look at the amphitheater once more. So there you go. That's the amphitheater on a perspective. So that is, uh, you can see it, a lot of people, 1,500 people. And it was made by Igorot craftsmen. So again, folks, this is uh, um, this is uh, a testament to the ingenuity of the Igorots. So I am heading towards the garden of or towards the cemetery of negativity. Okay, so it's going down, down, and down, and the. Traveler, 
calm researcher, calm English instructor is going down this uh, uh, ramp here, which is kind of slippery if it is wet. This is the cemetery of negativity, and there is won't be used, won't be used. It says there. in the 14th of December 1906 and won't be used there is a wreath a lonely wreath right there and uh, we move on to other other parts okay so I'm meeting some tourists here hi sir how are you where are you from uh, from Manila Las Pinas. Ah, no, from Las Pinas thank you for coming to the historical poor okay hi guys are kapu yes. oh thank you for coming we're actually from la union but we're doing a survey here for uh, for john hey but i'm already done so i'm <laughs> vlogging <laughs> we're from la union mom why don't you come to san juan la union ah we're planning to ah you're planning yes. to oh, okay <laughs> uh, i'm actually teaching at st louis college this is my name zenaida miranda, zenaida miranda. if you if you if you go to San Juan or to La Union. Um, I have a YouTube account, uh, Beyond Teaching with Zen. Beyond and Teaching. Yeah, Beyond Teaching with Zen. Uh, my name in, oh sorry, my name in uh, the Facebook is Zenaida Marquez, the one with glasses with an ID. If you perhaps would go to La Union, call me. Oh, yeah, sorry. yeah, get get in touch with me, I'll bring you. La uh, Union, uh, you can do surfing, right? Yes, yes, in San Juan. Surfing in San Juan. So, your name, ma'am? Oh, Nika and Ace. Ace. Okay, Nika, last name. Valioso. Oh, very, very unique uh, last name. <laughs> Nika and Ace Valioso. Yes. Okay, you you guys have Facebook? Oh, yes. Okay, so. Uh, Nika Valioso and Ace Valioso. Ah, sige, I'll just find. <laughs> and then, uh, friend request. Okay, okay thank thanks, you, Nika and Ace. Thank, thank you, you so much. My name is Zen, huh? Zen. Oh, enjoy, uh, You too, enjoy the day ahead. Now this is concerned, uh, concerned, L it's, oh, it's not possible, it says here, it's not possible, still not born, was conceived in 11 of November 1905, and look, all right there, I don't know what that signifies, hmm? it's not possible, still not born, now, ah, okay, all right, but there is what is this? Mm, I don't know. <laughs> okay, and we go on to the next, and we have some tourists over here. Okay, taga saan po kayo, my dear? Oh, Manila also face reveal. Ay walang tulog pareho. Okay, I'm doing my vlog. <laughs> yeah, nice meeting you. Oh, come to La Union. We're from La Union, actually. Yeah, from because we're from San Fernando, which is the capital city of, of La Union. But next to us is San Juan. San Juan, you know the famous surfing place? Yeah, if you come to La Union. I work at St. Louis College. My name is at St. Louis. This is Anaida Miranda. Yeah, ever you come. Hmm? Come to St. Louis College. Uh, pagpunta ng San Juan is on the right side. Hanapin nyo ako doon. Papasyal ko kayo. <laughs> nice meeting you. Di ko lang makita ang mukha nyo. <laughs> Your name? Daniel. Daniel and? Camille. Camille. Uh, sisters? Uh, friends. Okay, nice meeting you, Camille and Daniel. Okay. Yeah, ingat. Enjoy the rest of the day. And then, we also have here, no, no damn way. No damn way conceived. New Year's Eve 1919 didn't work out. <laughs> okay, didn't work out too bad. No damn way conceived New Year's Eve, but it did not work out. Allah Oh, naman. New Year's Eve. All right, and uh, another one here. Look, this area is really very. It's uh, really nature. There's still kind of wet because perhaps last night it rained. 
Oh, and let's study it. Hi, how are you? Let's study it. Delayed birth, stepchildhood, never reach maturity. Bad mm -hmm. Okay. And there's one last there. Oh, this is. Oh, this tree was adopted by Fernando Astom, by Dr. Astom. You see, here in Janhei, they uh, there is a program for people who are tree lovers to adopt a tree. Uh, they they give some money. They 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 pay for the upkeep of the tree. And this also this is a very good project of uh, the the how do you call this uh, uh, of Janhei in general to preserve the trees I'm gonna go there one last time oh it's kind of slippery and your old traveler has a hard time okay going down 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 it's kind of challenging but um, for the fun of it oh blame blame me will ya hey hey buddy how are you blame me will ya who are you blaming blame me will ya adopted July 4 of 1911 returned July 5, 1911. Alright. Mm. Uh, blame me, will ya? Yeah. And now, I think that's about it. Let me go up already. Slowly up the descent, going back. So, this is the cemetery of, of negativity. Uh, it means that whatever negativities you have in life, you'll just have to bury it in the cemetery of negativity oh there's still one part there so this is this is the lost cemetery negativism is a man's greatest self imposed infliction his most limiting factor is heaviest burden no more for here is buried the world's negativism for all time those who rest here those who rest here have died in vain not in vain those who rest here have died not in vain but for but for a stern reminder but for a stern reminder and as you leave this hill remember that the rest of your life be more positive have a good day treat today like it your last although it's the first of the rest oh very good the lost cemetery mm, the message is really so nice okay so this is the negative the cemetery of negativism uh, I actually started the wrong way this should be the entrance mm, okay all right so let me just take a look at the the others that are here mm -hmm. there oh only what only Chile this is the John Hay Management Corporation please don't step on the plants how can you step on the plants it's up there huh? <laughs> funny what plants do you what <laughs> look at this signage very funny please don't step on the plants but the plants are up there don't tell me I'm gonna put my foot up there and step on it come on or perhaps you mean the weeds or the plants here hmm okay I'm being negative again sorry here I am an only chill oh I am an only child but I am I am an only child born 21st of March 1908 died before his brother Kaya only child. So here, very, very, very sad face, sober face. And what are you holding? Huh? What are you holding? Uh, oh, too bad, only child. Well, bye bye, only child. You should be happy right now because only child, you know, you you are the heir, you are the sole heir of your parents' property. Mm -hmm. Okay. What do we have here? just can't shake it just can't shake it born 5 of october 1819 died of passivity 20 of may 1913 way why just can't shake it but why is your face like that what can't you not shake huh ah uh, baboy okay you're baboy naman what can't you not shake 
okay just can't shake it mm. there's another one here there's another one and I'm off to go I'm ready to go there's another one I I forgot ah, I forgot born humbly died some sometime I forgot oh you forgot but so you're touching your head because you forgot because your head does not contain anything Wait. oh my gosh monkey what did you forget you, for, you, for, you forgot to eat your banana mm -mm. kawawa naman si Ungui, si Mr. Monkey okay. alright uh, let's have one more there I'm stepping on the weeds and not on the plants alright I am not disobeying any law right here and the, this one is what is this a truly miserable day born in bloom lived without bloom dried in this tomb dried in this tomb and there is mr turtle so it's mr T turtle who died here dried in this tomb lived without bloom oh kaya pa na blue na blue blue okay bluer than blue all right let me have another one Again, I'm not stepping on the I'm just stepping on the grass. There's no sign. Don't step on the grass. Why? Why didn't I? Why didn't I? Born? He doesn't know. Live wondering why died for no reason. Oh my gosh. You don't know why you died because you died for no reason? Oh well, sorry for you. Oh, I have here. Oh, there is. See how natural this place is? There is a beautiful, I wish I can catch that. Oh, I cannot. She went away. A beautiful white butterfly. Last. Oh, there is a beautiful white butterfly. Not a team player. Not a team player. I hope you can see that. Not a team player. Born a star, lived a meteor, died in flames. Funny. Born a star, lived a meteor, but died in fl flames. Yeah, truly. They all die in flames, isn't it? In their own time. And what is this? Mr. What are you? I don't know. What are you? What are you? Must be some. Uh, have a big snout. I don't know what animal you are. I I I, I don't know. Uh, but anyway, you died in flames, so never mind. Okay, so I'm leaving the um, cemetery of negativity.